queens. queens. Welcome back to the Kendra and Canny Daily Show. I'm Kendra. And I'm Canny. And if you like our videos, don't forget to hit the bell, like, and subscribe button so you don't miss any of the sh the sh our videos. <laughs> Today is Tuesday, May 11th, 2021. And we celebrate Eat What You Want Day. Hmm. I know what I'm going Fact to Fact of the day. Yeah. <laughs> Fact of the day. On this day, people are encouraged to treat themselves by giving in to their sweet tooth. Carb loading with, without, having a, without, without having a marathon to run and eat breakfast for dinner. Because on Eat What You Want Day, no one can tell you what not to eat. <gasps> Wait, I want to celebrate that holiday. <laughs> no, you can't. This day was invented so people would take the pressure off themselves and just enjoy a good meal with their friends and family. After all, one day of falling off your diet routine isn't going to harm your health, which is a good sign. I want to celebrate Eat what you want day. It sounds so much fun. You can eat anything in the world. I can even eat you. Huh. Oh, that's not, no, you can't. That's not eatable. I mean, if you want, you can go eat dog poop right outside. I eat. You can eat anything. You, you taste good. Anything edible. You're edible. <laughs> You're meat. And, and, you, and you can celebrate this if you want to, and you can have whatever you want. Just for this day, you get to have a day off of your diet or whatever. And even if you're vegan. If you're vegan, you can eat some meat. And if you're not, what is it? The other one. Where you only eat meat, but not. Whatever I don't that, think that is. That, exists. Uh, that is a thing. That That's dinosaurs. Dinosaurs. <laughs> That's dinosaurs. Your dinosaurs do that. They have like, like, for meat, they have sharp teeth so they can bite into it. And we have like, you know how we ha you have pointy teeth? I have like fangs. Exactly. I don't know why. Everybody has fangs so you can bite into meat. Everybody has fangs? Do you have fangs? Yes. Everybody <laughs> has pointy teeth so they can bite into the meat. And the ones that are not pointy are for like salads and stuff. So we're a mix of two. But if you only eat meat, go eat some salad if you want to. And eat whatever you want that is edible and not humans. <laughs> not humans. <laughs> mm. Some interesting facts. Facts. Over 10 billion donuts are eaten annually in the U.S. <gasps> 10 billion? Oh my gosh. Wait. <laughs> Good morning, Continue. Continue. McDonald's has restaurants in over 126 plus countries. Mm. Well, there are more than 10,000 pizzerias in the United Kingdom and more than 61,000 plus pizzerias in the United States. <gasps> Just in the United States? Oh my gosh. That's a lot. I'm imagining like all the like it was not like even separated. It's like one whole big building of McDonald's. <laughs> Today in history, in 2000, India's population officially. <laughs> what did you say? Population. No, oh, is it says? Population. Population. There we go. <laughs> India's population <laughs> officially reaches one billion. Atsa Aurora named India's billionth baby. Wow. In 1981, the musical Cats first premieres in the West End, London. 1502, Christopher Columbus begins fourth and last trip to the Indies. Our shout out for today is to Israel Chapman. He's my friend from school. Also known as Bia. No, That's what no, he calls no, her. No. He calls her Bia. No, no, that, no, that was not him. That was one of his other friends. 
But okay. he, he, he accepted it. He could have just said, no, she's my friend. But he accepted he, it. He, no, he did accept it. He said, he, she's my friend. Yeah, but you're a girl. Yeah, he said, she's my friend. Girl. Friend. Girl. Friend. Girl. <laughs> the challenge, the challenge <laughs> for today is to draw what, what you want to eat and one minute. I know what I want to eat. And that might sound weird because oh, it yeah. sounds like without draw, eat what you want to eat in one minute. You won't, this is, it sounds weird because you're saying, like, it might be like, eat, take, go, go get some food and eat it in one, in under one minute, but no, we're drawing. No. And what was that necessary for? I don't know. All right, let's start. In three, two, one. Oh, wait, no, wait, okay. Two, one, go. Go. Okay. Okay, I know what I want to eat. I'm drawing McDonald's. <laughs> oh, no. Okay, I'm drawing McDonald's. Okay, well, <laughs> I made a weird McDonald's. Okay. Oh, I'm trying to think of other things to add. Wait, I'm going to add something real quick. What is that? Is that a fingerling? Is that a finger? Okay. What is that? Can't try it. It's what I want to eat. Something edible. I like a french fry. Gosh. I like french fry. And here is mine. Okay, well, now I know that I'm terrible at drawing. Here is um, my cheese, chicken leg, pancakes, and ice cream. Um, well, mine is just That's a ice cream? Happy Meal. And ice cream. Oh, that's a spoon. Yes. Uh, apparently, you didn't know that because I'm terrible at drawing. Don't say that. It's true. You didn't know what it was. You thought it was a finger at first, and then you said it's a French fry. So. Does that look like a spoon to you? Okay, Kendra. Um, it's I, a little twig. Okay. Can I start with a joke, please? Yes. Have you tried the new Donald Trump candy bar? No, I haven't. <laughs> it's incredibly rich, but it has no taste. <laughs> All right, your turn. What do you call a gummy bear with no teeth? Huh? No, no. <laughs> I can't <laughs> A gummy bear. <laughs> I just said it. <laughs> <laughs> oh my. Okay, the tongue twister. Do you want to say our tongue twister for today yes. or shall I? Uh, you should. But before we do, I want to say something. The person behind this camera doesn't know how to say what he wrote on here. <laughs> no. He put, to, what is it? Toboggan. Toboggan. It's the it's the bargain and he says to baguette. To bargain. To bargain. It's to bargain. It's in Spanish, right? Yeah, it's in Spanish, but in English it's to to bargain. All right, I'll continue. Our tongue twister for today is to begin to to bargain with far, first buy a toboggan, but don't buy t too big a toboggan. Too big a toboggan is too big a toboggan to buy a b to begin to b toboggan. I get it, and I don't. I completely. don't get it at, at all whatsoever. To begin to but to, 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 to begin to toboggan first, buy a toboggan, but don't buy a too big to a toboggan. Too big a toboggan is too big 
uh, to bog into buy the beginning to look up to uh, the bog. <laughs> this is a long time for us to. To begin to toboggan, first buy a toboggan, but don't buy a too big toboggan. Too big a toboggan, it's too big. To, it's too big a toboggan. Too big a toboggan to buy a to be to be to be bent to buy to begin to to the to to the to to the toboggan. <laughs> <laughs> to begin to toboggan, first buy a toboggan, but don't buy a too big a toboggan. Too big a toboggan is too big a toboggan to buy to begin to toboggan. To begin to the dog, to begin to the dog, to the dog. To begin to toboggan, first buy a toboggan, but don't buy a big toboggan. Too big of a toboggan could is too big a toboggan to buy a big to 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 buy to begin a to a to a to toboggan. I'm gibberish. To begin to the bargain, first buy a toboggan, but don't buy a too big a toboggan. Too big a toboggan is too big a toboggan to buy to begin a toboggan. <laughs> That's <pretty> good. <laughs> Today's birthdays: Salvadora Dali, Spanish painter. Oh, sorry. Wait. Wait. Okay, there you go. Obama wrote Obama. an arrow Span on mine. Spanish painter known for his work, the persistence. Of memory was born on this day in 1904. He passed away in 1989. Prince Royce, pop and bachata singer, is 32 years old today. Please go to our Facebook page and comment your birthday day so you can get a shout out. Happy birthday to any of you watching this video celebrating a birthday today. for our channel um, for Instagram so be on the lookout for that um, Kendra what is the weather in Pittsburgh today the weather in Pittsburgh is going to be sunshine and clouds mixed and high 54 Fahrenheit at night mostly clear skies low 6 36 Fahrenheit the Sun will rise at 607 a.m. and will set at 825 p.m. Our reminder for today is You are braver than you believe, stronger than you seem, and smarter than you think. Goodbye, my kings and queens. Please come back next time, and don't forget to share this video with your friends and family. Bye!